some sound advice there. Nice to see the sunshine shining across the area today. It was a gloomy start to our work week and that vitamin D and the warmth this afternoon, it just felt good for the soul, right? So if for some reason you've been cooped up, I've got some of our Skynet cameras pulled up. I can show you that big, beautiful golden glow that's outside. It took temperatures into the 60s today. That is a far cry from the 40s that we spent the first couple days at this week. It's not record territory. It's not terribly far off from it though. The record high for today is 73. So far, we've hit 66, so we're within 10 degrees of it. The last few rays of sunshine falling across Music City right now, not a cloud in the sky. It has been an easy afternoon for us weather-wise. This is a look at satellite and radar over the last six hours. We did have a couple clouds drifting around earlier, but they're gone. And that's what finally gave everyone the equal opportunity to warm up today. Clouds were not equally distributed yesterday, and it kept from some folks dreary and some folks on the warmer side. Everybody made it at least into the 50s today, some well into the 60s, and we're going to do this again tomorrow and again on Friday. Things start to break down as we head towards the weekend. So overnight tonight, we are back down into the 30s, upper 30s, so not quite as cold as it was this morning. This morning, we actually dipped into the 20s in some spots, but then another big gain, almost a 30 degree gain from where you start the day to where you'll finish it in the afternoon. Another afternoon with sunshine in the upper 60s. We'll have clouds drift about on and off for the next couple days, but that's it. It's Saturday that we still look at rain to return, and it's an interesting system that's coming in this weekend. While it does have enough energy uh, to create some showers and even a couple rumbles of thunder with it, it is incredibly moisture starved. So while we will have prolonged rain chances around, meaning you'll have a chance for showers Saturday morning, Saturday afternoon, Saturday night, at no point in the day is it just going to come down in buckets. We're really still, still only looking at a quarter to a half an inch total of rainfall. It will keep things much cooler and drizzly on Sunday, and there is still the potential that late Sunday night, a couple of those raindrops may briefly transition into a couple wet snowflakes, even a period of some flurries possible late Sunday into Monday. So the take home message for you here is enjoy the dry weather while you've got it. Enjoy the warm weather while you've got it because whether or not we see snowflakes remains to be seen, but we are all going to plummet back down into very chilly territory by next week, courtesy of that cold front. Saturday's rain chances do look to be a little tricky, and I know a lot of folks have outdoor stuff planned, so we'll break that down in more hour-by-hour -hour detail coming up at 5 and 6.